guys, what's up? We are live with a rocker, 8.30 a.m. at home workout today. We got a fun one. We got some new movements to throw in for you today. So check out what we've got. You guys need one dumbbell. Um, I guess you could do this without any weight if you want for the lunges, but ideally you've got one dumbbell in hand and you've got a place to do pull-ups. So whether that's an actual pull-up bar, whether that's a barbell laid across like a bench press height rack, where you guys can be bent over, or ring rows essentially with the barbell, or whether you guys have a tabletop where you can slide your feet underneath and pull up the chest, any of those row versions are gonna be okay. You can also do bent over dumbbell rows. We did those yesterday, but that would be in place of the pull-up. So in the perfect world, we're doing some sort of vertical pull. We just have to make do if you guys don't have a way to do that. And some horizontal pulling will work just fine. So here's what we've got for today. We've got four minutes of work. It's a Tabata circuit of frog jumps. So it's an air squat in which your arms stay straight, touch the ground, and jump. Right? So 20 seconds of frog jumps, 10 seconds of work for eight rounds. We're going to rest one minute. Then we're gonna go into five rounds of 20 high knee lunges. So I'm gonna let Brady demo these real quick. Uh, his dumbbell's been 10 pounds bigger than mine, so he gets the demo for his bonus work here. He's gonna step back. We're gonna explode forward like you're kneeing somebody in the chest. And he's gonna do 10 on one side, that's good. Then he'll switch legs, and he'll do 10 on the other side. So we wanna go in broken keys. You guys will hold that dumbbell in the front rack. Prescribed weight for men to be what Braden has at 50 pounds. Um, I'm going to drop down 10 pounds, use 40. Ladies are prescribed weight to be 35. Just scale as needed. Of course, if you guys don't have a dumbbell at home, use any weight at all in the front rack. You could do those with no weight as well. So, 20 of those, 10 on each leg, and then 10 strict pull ups or 10 rows. To make those rows harder, just elevate the feet. So the more parallel to the ground that your body is, the harder those are gonna be, right? Then we'll rest a minute, go through that five times, and we're gonna finish up with Tabata Mountain Climbers. We all know Mountain Climbers bringing those knees up to the chest, running in place essentially while holding a plank position on the hands. So we've got 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest for Tabata Search to finish up today. So let's run through these movements. Let's get you guys warmed up. Let's talk about some numbers we're going to try to hit. And then we're going to rock and roll this morning. All right. So let's start by getting in 10 air squats. Let's establish that first. So squat 10 times. And for these, we're going to pick up the tempo just a little bit. So we're just getting barely below parallel here. Keeping that chest up, right? Okay, so now to test see if you guys have the ability to do these with the arms touching the floor. Let's go ahead and keep our squat stance. We're going to bend down, grab the toes, and we're going to pull that chest up big. So since we're in this frog position for a deep squat here, right? This should be pretty comfortable you guys hang out in. Go ahead and stand up, shake out the legs if you need. Okay, so a couple options on these frog jumps. If that's a struggle, like if you guys kind of can only get to here, and you can't get to here, then we're not going to have you touch the ground with your hands. What I want you to do is just focus on good squats with a little bit of a jump. So as we do these, we're going to do five. We're just bring the hands up, jump, and explode, right? All right. So that's option one. Kind of like squat jumps, right? If you guys can, touch the ground with your hands. We're going to reach out and extend overhead. We're going to do three of the actual frog jumps. So arms stay straight, chest up big. All right. So either one is just fine. I prefer that you guys keep those arms straight. Just make sure that this stuff doesn't happen. Okay? We want to make sure that we're actually squatting down below parallel and not just hinging forward at the hips to touch the ground. All right. So 20 seconds of work. You got 10 seconds to rest. Let's talk about these lunges real quick. All right, so we're going to try these in place first without a weight. Just imagine you're holding a weight here. We're going to do three on each side. So you step back, slow through, driving the knee, and we're going to step directly back into that other lunge. If you need to tap your toe, which I'm going to do here, for a little bit of balance and pause for a second, it's okay. But if you can step through, we'd like to see you guys step through on all those. All right. Let's pick up the dumbbell. Let's try it. 
We're going to do another three on each side with your dumbbell. But you're going to want to hold it like this. Set it straight up and down so the dumbbell doesn't wobble when you guys do this. All right. Three on the right. Or left. Whatever you want to start with. Switch. Hi guys, about 30 seconds. Good morning, Instagrammers. Hope you guys are ready to make those legs burn. It's going to be awesome. All right. We got about 20 seconds here, guys. Remember, keep moving. Your goal is going to be 10 to 12 squat jumps or frog jumps on every one. 15, I think, is going to be a brutal number to hit. I don't think there's any way I'm going to hit that. All right. That's what we did in that Tabata circuit for our Gala 100s the other day. Here we go. We've got 10 seconds. So I'll try to keep you guys going. 20 seconds to work. Two, one, here we go. Three 
So you guys want to find this balance point up top. All right. We've got about 10 seconds here. We're going to go. Here we go. 
go. Knee above the hip crease. seconds guys so remember as you come to stand up out of that lunge I really want you to drive off of that front leg right bury that heel in the ground and explode up better to go steady and controlled and trying to power through these super fast 10 seconds
Good job, you guys are great. Okay, we're going to go 90 seconds. Get ready, chance to get caught up here. Come on, guys. So I want you to stay with us on this Tabata. So if you guys need to catch the other part short, take a one minute break, that's fine. legs moving. seconds on, 10 seconds off. Let's finish up the morning the right way. Stay with me here. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Ten. 
Ten seconds. Come on. Five. All right. Good job, guys. Just one of eight. Let's keep moving. Three, two, one. Here we go. Ten. Oh. Good job. Shoulders. Guys, doing great. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Here we go. Come on. Hang in there. Three, two, one. Here we go. Ten. Come on. Get them all. Come on. We're not stopping. Three, two, one. All right, last one. I know if you can, try to go and broke it. Here we go. afternoon for our daily 100s. We've got no strength and bodybuilding workout today at 1.30. It's a rest day. Tomorrow we're back with deadlifts and all that kind of good stuff. So, 4.30 this afternoon, daily 100s. We'll see you guys tomorrow morning at 8.30 for another at-home workout. Awesome job. We appreciate you guys as always. Have an awesome day.